What's up? Rob here on the OCV channel, Old City Vlog. People have been asking me, Rob, make some surf fishing videos again, you know? So, I figured, okay, I'm going fishing this morning. I'll make a surf fishing video. It'll be fun, right? They said it'll be fun, right? Yeah. So, got out there, you know. The only thing I grabbed was my phone. That was my uh, first mistake. Didn't bring the rest of my camera gear. Didn't bring... Uh, any of the GoPros or the action cams or any of that. Didn't bring a tripod. I just grabbed my phone. And, uh, yeah, that was my first big mistake. Got out there. First thing. I was the first one on the beach, even though I got kind of a late start this morning. Uh, then other people showed up. But, uh, yeah. Caught a few dinker fish. And uh, then things turned rapidly bad. Here we go. What's up? How's it going? Rob here on the Old City Vlog channel with uh, a little surf fishing video. Here's how a great day of uh, surf fishing can go horribly wrong. <laughs> uh, here I am casting out right at the beginning uh, using the Fish Bite Signature 12 foot rod with an Okuma Rockaway reel on it. The setup I just got recently had it for, I don't know, a month or two now, and uh, caught some pretty decent fish on it, some nice pompano and whatnot, but uh, yeah, the day started off great, you know, and yeah, then it, it rapidly turned sour, I'll show you that here in a minute, uh, here's another rod that I just recently got, this was the first day that I used this rod, it is a 13 foot over the bar rod uh, from Florida Surf Tackle up in Jacksonville, and uh, it's a pretty good rod. I'm pretty soaked on it. It's got an Abu Garcia 6500 on there, and uh, it's going to be replaced with a Pen Squall 2 that I ordered. I found a really good deal on it, and uh, it has a cosmetic blemish. should be here today. So that's what I'm going to put on it. I've had Abu Garcia's and Akios reels on my surf rods for quite some time. And uh, for some reason, I just decided, hey, I'm going to try a spinner. That's when I got the Okuma. And uh, I don't know. It seems to be working good. I'm looking forward to getting that pen, though, because I still like conventional reels. That's what I've used for years on my surface rod. So, uh, you know, catching fish here. I don't, don't show any that are on here because they were all, like, tiny little tidbits of fish. I was fishing the kiddie pool. Lots of tiny whiting. Lots of tiny catfish. I caught one whiting that, you know, it was big enough to keep, but it was right on the edge. And I tossed it back in thinking, oh, I'll catch bigger, better ones. Uh, I did catch a nice whiting that I lost right in the surf, which is the typical place where you're going to lose a fish surf fishing. But, uh, hey, you know, it is what it is. Uh, I caught lots of fish in a quick amount of time. Uh, just none of them were worth keeping. And uh, this is about when things went wrong. I was down the beach and uh, casting out the second rod. I go down to the third rod. And I uh, had my phone set up. And I didn't realize it at this point. But you can see the water came up and uh, knocked my phone off the cart. Now it's just laying there. And now it has been hit again and it, first it fell over then it fell off and conveniently you can see the reflection of the water in the wheel that is soaking wet that's why there's a reflection there and uh, you can see this wave coming up and uh, well that one got close but this one is the one that dunked it for the first time and after that, you see another wave come up. And this is the point where I look down the beach right about now. And to my surprise, I see my phone getting washed out to sea. <laughs> washed out to uh, the depths. 
And uh, I'm running down the beach. I'm panicking. I'm like, holy crap, holy crap. My phone just got washed out to sea. I don't see it. You know, I dove in the water. I'm looking all over for it. I spent, I don't know, two, three minutes, five minutes. I don't know. It seemed like an hour to me because I was in panic mode. <laughs> looking for my iPhone 14 Pro Max. You know, it couldn't just be a cheap flip phone. No, it's uh, an expensive iPhone. So, it got cut here because uh, it was just black tumbling around. But now you see me coming out of the water a few minutes later with my phone. And I looked down and I realized, holy crap, it's still recording. So, yeah, it recorded for a few minutes there, just black tumbling around in the water. Yeah, I just lost my phone. It uh, fell off my cart as I was filming something. It filmed underwater because after about two to three minutes, I found it. It's like a miracle that I found it because uh, it was all the way out there and somehow it got washed back in. Crazy. So, yeah, back home and, uh, you know, I, I caught some little dinker fish and, uh, you know, then my phone... It, it just like next thing I know it's uh, being washed out to sea <laughs> I'm running down the beach like in full panic mode chasing it you know and it goes under and it's like gone and I'm out there diving around swimming around I don't know two three minutes I don't know I cut the the film in there just because it, it must have turned facing camera facing down because it was just black and you could just hear <laughs> so uh, you know no sense in watching that for two or three more minutes but uh, yeah you see me coming out of the water with it by the grace of God I found it you know I uh, had pretty much given up hope and uh, thinking okay see how this insurance is going to work I hope I got insurance and I saw a wave swish up and there's my phone and it's like it's heading back out with the with the water so I ran a dove on it <laughs> oh man got it back and uh, it was still working still recording and I was just like wow hmm pretty cool thank god I got my phone back yeah because I was freaking out uh, I'm thinking who's gonna find it they're going to get all my info off of it. Is it still going to be working? Is it not going to be working? Uh, I was just like in full freak out mode. You know, it's only an iPhone. It's only a phone. It's only an iPhone 14 Pro Max. It's only, you know, over a grand. I mean, they gave me $800 trade-in, so I didn't pay that much for it. But uh, my measly phone payments are, they're, it's, I'll be due for an uh, uh, upgrade free upgrade yeah all right nothing free uh in december so end of the year you know i only got a few more months to go and uh yeah anyway it's got it back it seems to be working fine it's all good i'm actually using it to record right now and uh yeah it was uh by the grace of god i found my phone and then uh, i went down to reel in my lines pulled in a little dinker catfish and uh trying to be a good guy take the hook off of him he was foul hooked and uh trying to take the hook off of him and fumbling around with him and i got stuck in the finger like you know just like by one of the barbs have you ever been stuck with a saltwater catfish you know what it feels like it's not that bad when it happens it's a little poke you know no big deal and then for some reason it starts hurting really bad it starts throbbing the whole way home, my finger felt like I had a blowtorch on it, and uh, it was being turned on and off, on and off. Yeah, and then the next day, it felt even better. And the day before that, I had gone fishing, and I hooked myself in the stomach with a hook. Wasn't bad, but yeah, I had blood all over my shirt. It was, uh, I looked like a horror fest leaving the beach. People were like, you okay? Anyways, yeah. A rough couple of days of fishing no uh, nothing worth keeping for two days worth of fishing here so you know sometimes you're the hammer sometimes you're the nail I was the nail 
definitely these last two fishing trips so hopefully next fishing video will be a lot better and uh, it'll be less bs and more catching fish that's why they call it fishing and not catching i reckon you can't catch them all all the time but uh the best thing i caught today was my phone so there you go there you have it that's how a good day of uh, surf fishing can go horribly wrong in a matter of seconds there you go there you have it i'm out of here thanks for watching hit the subscribe button the bell button if you want to be notified for more crazy videos and uh i'm out of here thanks for watching and uh catch y'all later